Did all of you write your life scenarios yesterday? Even those who have written it before, you must renew your life scenario at least once a month. This is because your life's vision keeps getting upgraded. That is why it is very important to renew it every month. It is actually much better if you have it with you and renew it every time your vision changes. Actually, you need to declare what you have written in your life scenario to other people. I have started this big business and I'll make $50,000. You should also tell your husband, honey, you've worked hard for our family, but now I will be responsible for our life after retirement. What kind of car do you want? I'll buy you that car. You need to be bold with your words. You should also tell your children. Mom and dad will do all the work for you. So you don't have to worry about making money. Children, there are many things to do other than just making money. You need to become parents who can say such brave words. That is why you need to present your life scenario to those around you. But most people can't even say a word to others. Why? Because they're scared that it won't come true. Most people think, I will just tell them when it comes true. And in most cases, they just bury it in their hearts. You shouldn't do that. You need to tell other people about your goals, especially those who are close to you. That is because we're all weak, including me. We're all weak. There's a high chance that humans, including myself, will give up when we face difficulties. Sometimes you will feel brave like an ox, but sometimes you feel like you've become a weak little lamb. But if you let others know about your dreams, then even when you face those difficult times, you won't quit, at least because you gave your word to those around you. That is why you must tell about your dream to others. And it doesn't matter if these people believe you or not. You must tell those who don't believe you and those who believe you will be your supporters. Those who don't believe you might blame you next time when you have become successful. Why didn't you tell me about this opportunity before? In order to prevent this, you must tell them. Then you'll be able to say, I did tell you. Why didn't you follow me back then? Actually, those who oppose you will ultimately end up changing their minds. They'll say, I knew you were going to make it. And they'll be able to follow you later. You need to let other people see the difficult path that you're taking from the beginning of the journey. If you show up three to five years later as a successful person, people will not come follow you. They will say, it worked because it was you. You're naturally a gifted person. That's what they're going to say. But if you show other people the entire process of the journey, the process of painfully overcoming challenges, then they'll be able to follow you later on. And when they follow after your path, they will say, yes, that person had a rough time before too. But since he overcame his challenges and made it, I will be able to make it as well. This is just the natural process. That is why you must show your difficult situation to those around you without any shame. However, in order to show other people this process, it requires a lot of courage. Courage is not about being unaffected by fear. Courage is facing such fears, even if they are present. Your goal is to make 50 to $100,000 a month. And you all know that the probability of failure is actually greater than the probability of success. 
You all know this by instinct. That is why you're scared. You are scared that it will not pan out as you've planned. Courage is facing such fears as these. Success is for those who have courage. Those who have faced such fears become successful people. However, those who were scared of failure and did not tell others, they will remain as failures. I hope that all of you will have the courage to face your fears so that you can succeed. Let me tell you a secret today of how to succeed in this business. If you know this method, anyone can be a guru in sales. Anybody. When I realized this secret, I thought to myself, I have nothing left to learn about sales anymore. At that point, I had become a master of sales. When people talk to other people, most of them think, will the other person change their mind because of me or not? Will they listen to my words or won't they? They have these kinds of worries. So they deeply ponder about what they're going to say the next day. But let's say the other person does not heed your words. Then that person becomes disappointed. Then there's another instance where someone follows you, though you didn't say anything important. There's actually not much of a difference, even if you think about what you're going to say for hours on end the night before. Many people say that sales is hard. I ask, what's so difficult about it? They say that they think about what they're going to say the night before they meet the consumers. And they wake up in the morning and say, oh, sales is so difficult. The other person may or may not listen to you, regardless of whether you thought about what to say or not. The important thing is that you just go and talk to others. Do you know about Atomy? It has good and affordable products. I started a business where you can earn $50,000 a month. Do you want to join me? Let's go to the seminar together. Try this product. Just keep talking to people from all the people you talk to. Some will accept it and some won't. It's all up to the listener. That's when I realized the law of own mind. Who is it up to if they're going to listen or not? It's up to the listener. But who is it up to whether I'm going to speak or not? Well, that's up to me. All I can do is control what I can do. The listener is the only one who can decide their attitude. One more time. Who is it up to to speak about atomy? It's up to you. Just do as you please. Do atomy. It's good and affordable. Isn't your life difficult? Do you have a good retirement plan? Just say whatever you please. And it's up to the listener whether they will show interest or not. Of all the people you talk to, there might be someone who is searching for a new opportunity because their business is not good. Another person might have a business that is doing well, but maybe they feel trapped inside their store all the time. That person might have been thinking, is this how I'm going to live the rest of my life? That is a person who very well could have been looking for an opportunity to live a more exciting life. All you had to do was tell that person about network marketing. And that person could have come running after you. It's all up to them. Repeat after me, the law of own mind. If you just realize this principle, there is no pressure in sales. Do you really think the Atomy business is that hard? It's not hard at all. As long as you have a mouth and can speak, all you have to do is speak to other people. Do you know about Atomy? They have good quality and affordable cosmetics. Do you want to join me in doing big business? Do you have a good retirement plan? Just do as you please. If you keep talking to people, there will be those who are really desperate to do atomy. There are rich people 
who are like the following. They might have a retirement plan, but they might not have enough to live a life of giving to others. They might be able to live without aid from their children, but maybe they want to buy their children a house. There are people who can't be that generous, but they want to. If you tell such people that there is a business where they can make fifty to a hundred thousand dollars a month and ask them to test out whether what you're saying is true or not, then there is a chance that amongst so many people, there can be a competent person who will come under you as a partner. Something you couldn't dare to imagine can unfold in your life. After being connected to a massive network of different countries, you might finally hit the jackpot. In our company, many of our leaders have low academic credentials. There is one here as well. She's a crown master. I noticed that there was a line full of such members. They had only graduated from elementary school. But under them, they hit the jackpot from a Taiwanese partner. They can't speak Taiwanese or even English for that matter, but they got connected to Taiwan somehow. And that line in Taiwan grew exponentially. So that line just exploded in growth. That's how you become a crown master. Why don't you stand up? Don't just sit there. Yes, you can see she's sitting right over there. She didn't say anything until she was promoted to royal master. That's when she confessed she had only graduated from elementary school. What's fortunate about this business is that anyone can succeed here, regardless of their own talent. That is why it's very important for all of you to have a vision. For people who are healthy and can walk, we can invite them to join the Atomy business. But there are those who cannot join because of their health or maybe they're physically challenged. For these people, we should continue to help them with our givings and donations. When I heard yesterday that the new Imperial Master He Jung Lee decided to donate one million dollars, I was very touched. I was more touched than when I donated $10 million. It was truly an inspiring moment. Our leaders are truly outstanding. They are truly amazing. I know that she had a difficult background growing up. I know her past situation in the beginning. I said that she was a game foul because she picked so many fights, but now that foul has become a swan and decided to donate one million dollars. Wow, that is truly amazing. It was indeed a moment where my heart just burst. I am also very proud that Atomy has become a home where we can be touched with such pleasant surprises. I will conclude this lecture hoping for all of you to be able to enjoy a successful life like that of the new Imperial Master, Hye Jung Lee. Thank you very much.